Hi guys, I'm Griver here, and this is my Raid Shadow Legends Diary. So, the second gift, definitely not as good as the first one. I hope, like, I thought that they were gonna, like, go increasing order better and better and better, but I guess increasing order, they're just going worse, worse, and worse. Maybe the last, maybe the last gift is, like, 500 mystery shards, because yay! Anyway, so, let me go ahead and pick that up right now. I'm not buying anything, so... So what I'm about to do now, there's some of these tournaments going on or whatever. Um, I've been banging my head at Spider's Den. I'm not doing that today, at least not on this video. What I'm going to do is now I have the final key for the final floor of Doom Tower or keys enough for that. And from this, I should get a Void Shard. Awesome. So Frost Spider, we're going to put in Raglan. We're going to put in Ultimate Gaelic for the HP burn that we're going to need. Um, let's go ahead and change this by rank. Now, let's go ahead and put Doom Priest in because then she'll ensure that Ultimate Gaelic keeps that increased attack up. I could do Gorgor up. That would speed up the entire team. All right, let me think on that for a little bit. Uh, I guess still of the Drakes. I love running still of the Drakes. Should I put in Iron Brago? I feel like I might need some more crowd control. Oh no, I took Dark L. Hain six star yesterday for this purpose. So let's how about maybe use her. That might be a smart idea. So here we go. If I beat this, I am done with Doom. It'll be the first time I've ever beat Doom Tower on normal. So come on, chop, chop, chop. All right, here we go. I'm going to start off in auto. And truth be told, I think once I get to the Frost Spider, um, because the frost spider is just tanky as all get out, what I might do is basically just come back after the spiders and like show a little bit, but then come back after because I'm sure that spider is going to take a long, long time. And I don't, I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to watch the same things over and over and over again. So, um, we'll get through these waves. These waves seem relatively easy which actually kind of worries me. It makes me think that the boss is just going to be a monster. And I'm actually tempted to, after this, try like the first floor of Doom Tower on hard. Um, don't know if I'm ready for that, but hey, what's the worst that could happen, right? I'm not going to lose anything out of it. So, and now I'm wondering if I should have put like a decreased defense champion in here at some point, but... I think as opposed to trying to speed up killing the frost spider that is is better served that I um, make sure that everything's going the way it should. Just build the team strong enough to survive, have the proper HP. Yeah. Let's see how much damage uh, Ultimate Gaelic does. And this is why we have um, Dark El Hain in. And Doom Priest is actually really good for this as well. Doom Priest will ensure that um, those freezes get purged once she gets her turn because she purges one buff uh, with every turn and heals. Um, and Dark El Hain, whenever anyone receives the freeze, will attack with her Death's Majesty, which you just saw there. Um, I was kind of worried for a second with how, how low our health got after that first attack, but seems to be okay. This is going to be a while. We are, oh, we're doing 3,000 damage. Put a, put a HP burn. HP burn does also cause uh, heavier damage, right? It weakens the spider, correct? Boom. See the Death Majesty go off again? If Doom Priest, I think, is faster than Scylla the Drakes, he should be there resisted. Was that the HP burn that just got resisted? Does my ultimate Gaelic not have enough accuracy to land his HP burn? Well, he hasn't done his, um, they removed the buff too. Oh, damn you. Ooh. Um, I feel confident that we'll beat this team, but that we'll, that we'll beat the Frostbiter, but I'm not 
This is a this is kind of a trip. It feels like it's gonna end up taking hours. Because if they're just removing the buff, I mean, granted, you can get it back, but that's a lot, right? All right, so is this the HP burn? No, it didn't say anything resisted. I would like to know where he stands right now in terms of his uh, cooldowns. Mm. Decreased accuracy, that's no good. But we got the two spiderlings on their sides, uh, stun. Okay, so he landed the HP burn on the one spiderling. So I'm wondering if once, once we get through it a little bit, if the, once we kill the spiderlings, if the HP burn will then be able to apply on the, let's see, let's see. It didn't say resist it, did it? I'm really curious right now. Gotta love that relentless gear. Extra proc, extra proc, extra proc. Give us that turn meter. So glad I made the change, taking Raglan out of that um, retaliation set and putting her in relentless has been a huge benefit. It actually almost came back to bite me in the, you know, with Scarab King because she was procking extra turns and that was actually running her shield down, so. Okay, so I think his A2 was coming up. Oh, see all the Drake's also in Relentless Gear and she just got three in a row. That is awesome. Gotta love that. All right, so I think his A2 is coming up which lays down an HP burn. If he's under attack in the decreased turn meter, about 10%. So, let's see. No, I don't think that was it. I'm tempted just to remove it from auto just to see where everyone is right now. Why didn't, did she do her death's majesty there? Okay. There we go. Crushing hopes, that's it, that's, and it got resisted. So the HP burn got resisted. Why was it resisted? We. If this ends up being, a, this might end up being a huge, huge problem. All right, I'm gonna give it one more shot. His A3 is probably still two turns away. Oh no, that's it. And it got resisted. Oh no, I don't think I have enough accuracy. So what I'm gonna do is I'll cut here and then I'll come back depending on the result. But if he doesn't have enough accuracy, we're screwed. I'm hoping that it's just that the spiderlings are alive and so that's why it's not landing for some reason. That doesn't really seem logical, but I guess I'm desperate and hoping right now. Um, but I want to see if it just keeps getting resisted even when the spiderlings are down. And in fact, I'm tempted to start targeting the spiderlings. Anyway, I'll cut here and then I'll come back later. Okay, so I realize now, finally, after 15 minutes of waiting for it to get around, that the spider, frost spider, keeps resisting the HP burn. It hasn't landed once. So what I'm gonna have to do is go find a way to increase Ultimate Gaelic's accuracy. And truth be told, I don't even know how much I should have. That's the first question. I have 223. What is this banner? This is an attack banner. Do I have an accuracy banner anywhere? Nope. Is there accuracy on any of this gear that I could have a glyph on, add a glyph to? Oh, there's one. Let's see. Let's go over here. I got accuracy right there. Give me seven. Probably give me four. Five. Okay. Ugh. Ugh, ugh, ugh. Let's see. Is there any more? Oh, there's accuracy there I could add. Let's go ahead and... Oh. Eh, I'm not worrying about that right now. 
three. Oh, does anybody know how much accuracy I need for this damn spider? No accuracy. So I've gotten it up to 231. And I'm not sure that will be enough. And this accuracy here, I could try to upgrade this shield to level 16 and hope that it lands on accuracy. Damn, that's gonna take forever though. I'm gonna do it and I'll just like 2X the video or whatever, but I'm gonna try that now. And as you can see there, 1.9 million used, could not get up to in level 16. I hate this game when it does this stuff. It's so ridiculous. Oh wait, no, it had a glitch. That's why I wasn't doing it past half a million. All right, let's try this again. Okay, apparently there's some kind of glitch going on because it keeps giving me the half million back. I'm connected to the internet, so it should work. All right, go back in and then try it one more time. Let's see what happens here. Come on, half a million, come on. I've already spent 1.4 and you guys make me spend 1.9 twice. Just there's some kind of glitch there or whatever, but come on. Just one time. Okay, I don't know what's up with the game, but it keeps doing this. So I'm going to restart the game and then come back. So I restarted the game, got back in, and it didn't land on accuracy. So that was a waste. Oh, that was a waste. Okay, so now I'm just stuck. Is 230 going to be enough? I'm thinking it's not. And I have no accuracy anywhere else that I could really add. Ugh, 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 lifesteal. I think that's it. I think I'm just gonna have to go with this. There's accuracy here. So I'll lose crit rate, which is kind of necessary, but I don't need the crit rate right now because I'll have Doom Priest in. So what I'll do is I'll exchange this out. This will give me 243 if I have enough. Yeah, I think I have enough silver to switch. And then maybe even switch back when I'm done, but at this point, I need the accuracy. Yeah, all right, so let's equip that. 50K. And then I'm going back at that Frost Spider. And we'll see, we'll see if it's enough. Hello, let's go. All right, so I'm gonna attack this thing now. Uh, I hate when it does this. Uh, okay, that should be enough, right? I think that's good. Okay, so here we go. And I'll cut back to this when I've gotten to the end. So I had an issue with video here, so I don't have what happened, but let's just say I still didn't beat the freaking spider. So. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, please subscribe, and I'll see you tomorrow.